Yes, sir, we are bringing to you live in 2024 the new government house road that is under construction. Yes, sir, in 2023 we have brought this road to you. I think it's twice but this year this is the first time that we are bringing it to you so that uh, you will be on the same page of what is happening you know concerning that uh, all important to road so but then in this particular update we have decided to bring something new in addition to what we used to see what is new is that we decided to move a little bit further to see what is happening at the other you know tail end of the road so in this video you are going to see everything that you need to know and uh, exactly what that uh, tail end looks like one thing we are sure is to bring to you current updates of events that is happening that you need to know yes we are going to start our journey from uh, this road that uh, connects the government house coming from aroma and we decided to have a critical detailed look of the area as usual Well, I observe uh, in this video that uh, this particular place now is uh, Nita. This is where they dump refuse. Unlike before, you know, this place you see there's been littering everywhere and uh, the road is so unkept. But today, well, uh, it looks better. Probably uh, they just did the job of recent. So, but that is that is what we observed you know around here but um, another thing is the bushy area sometimes i wonder what is happening why is it difficult to keep the environment clean even at the heart of the uh, government premises just imagine here now you see bushes around at the middle of the road by the side of the road you know such sites is not uh, proper and is never in order even if you say that the government house is still under construction what about this square that is there what about the judiciary that is behind what about this the new federal secretariat by the right here people can assess this secretariat through this road so i don't know why the bushy area The fact still remains that uh, the truth is bitter, but we must say the truth at all the times. Because I know that uh, it may not go well with some people, you know, hearing about what we are saying concerning what is happening. Well, um, that is what we are known for. We talk what is happening and uh, the truth about the whole issue. And that still remains that this place is bushy, it's not uh, well, you know, taken care of.
we are still making our observations and we are moving directly towards the government house to have a better look of what is happening. This is the Secretariat, the Federal Secretariat that was commissioned May last year. Even the environment of that Secretariat is very, very unkept. This is the judiciary. So I don't see the reason why this place should be abandoned as if uh, the place is in Sambisa Forest. Some places, the occupants or the the users of the building are supposed to take care of them. Like this uh, federal secretariat near those fences is not government that is supposed to do that. But some places still remains that uh, the government are supposed to take care of it, like the roads and uh, some other important areas. But like I said earlier, it's because the government is not doing their own part. They cannot you know, take action regarding the private individual premises. If government is doing their own part very well, it's as easy as ABC to visit an area that is not well kept and seal it up. It's very, very easy. So, but they don't have that moral justification to do that because they have failed in their own Part. Well, um, we will keep saying the truth concerning the matter, but not forgetting the fact that the government is trying to do their best, but their best is far, far beyond or below expectations. You can see last time we visited here, yeah, this place was you no. Know, uh, very deep, but now they are filling it up, moving towards uh, the other side. So let's go up there and see how that side looks like. So this is uh, right in front of the new government house entrance gate. That is where we are. So, but um, 
looking from here now i observe that that area that used to have a very deep you know portion is now filled up from this place that i'm looking at but we are going closer Yes, this place now used to be very deep, but now it has been filled up probably for them to have, you know, a better landscape to perform their duty. You know, they are yet to bring down the gutters here. So, but I know that the gutters are coming down gradually. Yes, you can see the area that the gutters have reached. That the gutters are fast coming down towards the government house axis. So, but let's see how it goes. We are moving a bit up to take our observations. Yes, so the name of the contractor of this project is Geld. Geld is the contractor's name. And uh, we are moving further to take a critical look of the environment.
Yes, uh, that is the government house back gate. You can look at it here. That's the back gate. So, but uh, our focus is on the road construction that is going on. And like I said, we are going to have a different look today. We'll move down this road and see how that downside is looking like. Yes, viewers, uh, um, if you have money that you want to invest in land, you can come over this side and buy a suitable and comfortable land. With my little knowledge, I believe that this place is going to boom. The price is going to take off, you know, from what it usually be. If you watch now, the road that is going on, once they complete it, that one is another way of uh, that will make this area to skyrocket the price aside that when the government house is completed that is another big advantage to this axis well um, let's move down and see what is happening
well um it is not out of place if you are interested in getting any property here or anywhere you might as well contact us and we find the contact uh, you know that is genuine so that you can get your property Yes, having a down view of this place, you can see what it looks like. So the road continues down from here, but where it ends for now, we don't know. But uh, information has it uh, that the road for now is going to end down that side, that uh, a river is there. There is one little river that passes at that back. As information that we got for now, but ours is to give you updates. If anything is happening, we are to update you. So let's not uh, be faster than our shadow. We will still bring to you updates of events that are happening. Thank you. Yes, this area now is uh, is still back of Ifite. 
So you can still assess this downside that place you are looking at now from that if it a road it's just for you to take by the left and uh, move towards that area well uh, the issue that side is uh, some places at the interior of that table land you know uh, is swampy a bit swampy some of the part of that interior not all so if you are going that side you better watch out you know and be sure of what you are doing Yes, we are taking our reverse view, having seen what that uh, area looks like. This place is uh, inside the new government house.
yes if you have not subscribed to your Life channel please click on the subscription button and the notification bell and don't forget to like this video share this video for people to get updates and uh, you know to be on the same page on what is happening people are likely to get and gain enough information whenever we post video like uh, people that wants to buy land or any other information or just to be updated with the trend of events please share this video don't keep it to yourself Yes, uh, uh, we are back in the front of the government house and just like I said, our people must learn how to keep the environment clean. But as usual, when they fail to do their responsibility, what happens? The government is supposed to step in to force them to do the right thing. But here, the government is falling short of their own part in keeping the environment clean or probably there is a serious arrangement on how to do that. But for now, this is what we are seeing on ground. 
a bushy environment everywhere roads you know very sandy but though this one is still under construction this is not part of the road that we are talking about we are talking about freshly done roads and older roads that are still very very unkept well um let's keep See all this area now. Even the drainage system has been taken over by bush. You see grasses growing everywhere. Everywhere looks very, very untidy. That is not supposed to. Thank you. 
Yes, sir. This is the um, junction. If you take right, you are going down to Obuno. Obuno towards Roban Axis. Then, if you take left, you are going to the uh, road, the other road that leads to the Secretariat. But we are moving forward. We are moved, taking front, which is the road that leads to Aroma Junction, where we commenced this movement.